remember, we're not here to make trouble. You start something, I get unhappy. Calio, of all the gifts you've sent to me, this is truly the finest. An agent of Imperial Intelligence. How marvelous. I don't understand what you mean. Kaleo has been selling information to the Revolutionary Edge Brigade ever since she joined the Empire. What are you doing? Imperial security data, spaceport blueprints, the names of powerful people, useful things. But now, she's gone beyond the call of duty. You've been selling our secrets to anarchists. It's not how he makes it sound. This wasn't what we agreed. Why bother keeping it private when your associate dies anyway? She's more useful dead than alive. Her hands and eyes can get us through biometric security scans. This isn't a harvest job. Then I apologize for misreading our agreement, but this is too promising an opportunity to pass up. Tell me what's going on. Tell me the truth. Damn you, Agent. And damn you, Weezer, for making me do this. No mercy. Calio, you were never a believer, but siding with the Empire? I didn't want to pick a side. So yeah, I sold him a few secrets. He paid better than you do, and it's not like I got you in trouble. You're only digging yourself in deeper. Why? What's the big deal? I didn't talk about the missions. I'm not stupid. He was into bombing spaceports and raiding transports, not espionage and conspiracies. The Empire gave you a job. It gave you protection. In return, you sold us out. What? Us? I didn't sell you out. I kept you from knowing for your sake. You should know by now that I am never going to care about the Empire. Not like you do. Not at all. I don't need you to care, but I can't have a traitor on my team. Step out of line again, and you're dead, understand? Yeah, I understand. I'm your freaking prisoner. Let's get out of here. General Rakton and Darth Barras request additional agents. Relay to Station 7. Updating tactical projections. I have three fixers who need extraction from the Vuta. Listening posts are done, but... Sir, go on ahead. I'll have the Minders debrief your team while you wait for Keeper. It looks like you're in crisis mode. What's going on? It's been like this since the fighting intensified. We've rushed training, gone to 16-hour shifts. Sir, Operation Kingstalker needs you. I have to go. I'm sure we'll talk more. Raina Temple, your debriefing. My first. I'm a little nervous. It isn't my office anymore, but Keeper is occupied and I thought we should talk. It's been a long time, Agent. I haven't seen you since Eradication Day. Keeper said you were promoted to Minister of Intelligence. Yes, my wife says the position suits me. Scan complete. No listening devices found. It'll broadcast white noise for ten minutes. Complete privacy, even from your master. 
We may as well be honest. I know about the stolen files. I know you discovered your brainwashing and freed yourself. And yes, I was responsible. Did you know that Arden Koth was controlling me? I was his puppet. That was unfortunate and unplanned. Darth Jadis made no friends when he rose to power, but the other Sith had to act quietly. They wanted insurance against you. If I hadn't approved your programming, they'd have found another way and I'd be dead. I don't plan to tell anyone you're free. The Republic had the keyword. Where did they get it? That's an excellent question. The SIS should never have possessed Imperial brainwashing codes. Arden Koth's shuttle was found abandoned in space without any data on your shadow arsenal. And according to our records, there's no evidence of an Agent Hunter ever existing. Care to explain that? Someone, your hunter or his employer, is manipulating this war for his own ends. Someone with access to both Republic and Imperial resources. If someone gave Arden Koth your keyword, we need to find out who and why. What sort of person could pull those strings? Imperial intelligence and SIS. Not to mention Jedi and Sith. Let's not elaborate on theories until we have facts. Fortunately, the trail is still warm. Yesterday, a man fitting Hunter's description boarded a shuttle to the Eisen IV asteroid colony. Nine hours ago, we received this message. Imperial Fleet Command, this is Representative Omana Trog of the Ison 4 Mining Colony. We have been monitoring your victories in this sector. While we continue to accept refugee transports, her defense systems are minimal and our population is 90% civilian. We cannot afford a confrontation. Under Republic law, I am authorized to discuss terms of surrender. All weapons powering down. Our forces will arrive there tomorrow. We don't know if the colony's surrender is related to Hunter's arrival, but I want you after him. What would he need at a Republic mining colony? The Watchers are collating data on the facility and known occupants. Hopefully they'll find out. If not, it's up to you. Can you smell that? Those are bodies. Stop right there, you slime. No Imperial sits foot in my home. Your colony surrendered. The Republic won't protect you. And you think you can threaten me? Tell me what's going on. Piece of filth. Someone sabotaged colony control. It started two hours after the surrender. First the tram accident, then the air filters, and the decompression. Assassin protocols and the medical droids? We surrendered. Why did you do it? Whoever's behind this wasn't one of ours. <sighs> then who? Sedative administered. Lethal overdose possible. I'm sorry, sir. He's dying. If there's anything we need to ask... I need to know if you've seen an SIS agent. Codename Hunter. What? The SIS? Yeah. He went to colony control before we lost contact. I don't know if he made it out. But now it's sealed up tight. No one could make it past... The, past the... Hold still. I have some painkillers. <gasps> 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 
not enough. But thank you. I know they're Republic, sir, but can we avenge them anyway? <laughs> 